This is an ABC 10 News update. And good evening, I'm Steve Atkinson in the ABC 10 News studio. We are learning grim new details about that deadly house fire in La Jolla that killed a man and his granddaughter. The medical examiner says that 80 year old Robert Keefe's son put a kerosene soaked shirt in the fireplace and fell asleep. Well, that ended up catching the house on fire. The son's 11 year old daughter jumped from the second floor into his arms. But his other daughter, nine year old Angie Keefe, is autistic and stayed in bed. She died, as did Robert Keefe, who could not get out. Here are the latest coronavirus numbers in San Diego County. 236 new cases were reported today. That brings the total now to 33,393. Six new deaths were also reported. That brings that total to 608. Coming through in a big way to help feed San Diegans in the middle of this pandemic. Today, Foster Farms made one of the largest donations to the San Diego Food Bank. A truckload of frozen chicken. The, floor, uh, the uh, food bank estimates the delivery will provide about 70,000 servings for local families. Foster Farms says it's been able to provide more than 3 million servings to food banks across the West Coast. Heating up there right now. Got to be careful this week. Here's our Angelica Campos with your forecast. That's right, Steve, especially this weekend. We're going to be adding another three to five degrees tomorrow with an excessive heat warning starting on Friday. I have more coming up.